I hope you're all well. Today I wanted to show you what I got for my birthday last week. I normally hate these kind of videos because I feel like they come across a little bit braggy and I don't want you to think that's what I'm doing at all because I'm not. Um, I just, I don't know, I just thought it might be quite nice to show you guys what I got and it, you can use it as a kind of gift guide inspiration. I didn't get loads and loads of presents, I didn't get particularly expensive gifts, they were just really really lovely presents and I thought it might be useful because I love finding out what other people get for their birthdays and Christmases and Mother's Day and all of that and I think it's quite nice to see, yeah, just get a bit of inspiration. So I will start with what I got from Pete. He gave me my presents like a week before um, in case I needed to change them over. So he knows that I've just got back into my fitness and I've been going to the gym loads, so he got me loads of gym goodies. So the first thing, these Nike trainers, which I absolutely love. So they're just kind of the lighter pink on the front and then darker pink on the side. And what I really, really like is that they've got this kind of orange tongue bit. And I just really, really like them. I think it's really good when you're going to the gym um, to have some really like leery gym clothes, just something a bit bright to make you feel a little bit more motivated. I don't know, I know a lot of people like to kind of blend in and just have black and white and stuff, but I think bring on the brights. Um, so the next thing is this bright pink sports bra, and it's actually reversible, so you can also, if you cut out the label, so I'm sure it is, oh yeah it is because it's got the Nike sign on the inside, so just the grey mesh on the outside, and I really like that, it might be the wrong size though, so I might have to take that back and change it. And that's also a Nike one. And then you'll see a bit of a theme. Bright pink Nike sports bottle, because I've been using Pete's one, so he was probably throwing a little hint out there to stop using his one. And then some just plain black Nike trousers, which go down to, I don't know if you can see, just kind of below the knee. Just nice, comfy ones. And the last bit of gym gear is this. Nike bag. I never normally use a bag because I'm normally just in and out of the gym but at the new gym um, I can put Jasper in the creche for longer and because we're living closer to my parents I can drop in there so I'll have time to go and have a shower and I don't know if I need to do yoga and stretching afterwards and stuff I can take my yoga mat so yeah really really nice loads of pink Nike goodies and then the day before my birthday he gave me this because he flew home from Manchester, so he got it in duty free. And it's the Lancome La Nuit Trezor, Trezor, I don't know how you pronounce it, but I, you can't really tell, but it's a really nice shimmery box and it's a perfume and it's so lovely. So I'm normally a bit weird when it comes to perfume because I've always used um, Chanel Coco Mademoiselle and any other one, I'm just like, oh, I don't know. I just always go back to that one. So when I saw that he'd got me perfume, I just thought, I really hope I like it. And I love it. It's an absolute winner. I think it might even be my new fave. It looked like I had glitter in it then, but it's not. It's just bubbles. So it comes in a really cool, like pointy, diamondy shaped bottle. And it's just so lovely. It's... I'm bad at describing things, but kind of like a sweet toffee smell. And Coco Mademoiselle is really sweet as well, so that's obviously my kind of, my thing. Oh, it's just so lovely. And it reminds me of good times. I don't know what good times, but it just makes me feel really happy when I smell it. So he did good. He did very good. And my sister lives in Sweden, and she sent me this really lovely kind of beaded necklace. And I think... It's just really nice and boho -y. it'd be really great for a festival or something. The make is Gina Tricot, Tricot. Um, so I don't know if that's like a, a Swedish make or, I'm not sure, I should probably look it up. But yeah, I thought that was really lovely, nice and summery. And then I got just like gift cards and money and things like that. From my mum and dad, they, well my mum took me shopping so I could choose what I wanted. And she'd been using loads of Liz Earl face stuff and I love it, every time I stay at my parents I always use her stuff. So yeah, she took me to get my own. And I will do a review of this. I'll probably do like my daily skincare routine kind of thing because I am obsessed with it. It is so, so amazing. Today's the first day I've worn makeup since my birthday because I've just loved my skin since I've been using this. So you get the Cleanse and Polish Hot Cloth Cleanser, just like this. And then you get two muslin cloths to go with it, which I scrunched back in the bag because I've already been using them. And then you get the Instant Boost Skin Tonic. And the Skin Repair Moisturiser. 
So they are so, so, so brilliant. They're the kind of basic steps. And then when you buy the pack, you also get the soothing eye lotion. And then we also bought, like me and my mum both got one, the brightening treatment mask. And I just, they're, they're the kind of products that just smell like you're in a spa. They're so lovely. Like, I don't even know what that smell is. It's just really fresh and clean and I love using it. Now I just, I make the time for my skin because just, I enjoy doing it. Whereas before I'd be like, oh, I have to take my makeup off. Now I actually love doing it. Me and my mum popped to Zara and I picked up a couple of bits. The jeans I've worn religiously since I got them. So they're a bit dirty. I did actually grab them out of the wash pile. But these are just the mid-rise skinnies in a size 6. I got some size 8s from there. And I don't know if they're 40, but oh, I got them when I was pregnant. So I probably like stretched them out. But they just fall down on me, which is a little bit worrying. I've definitely lost too much weight since I had Jasper. But yeah, so I got these in a 6. They actually fit me really nicely. And then my aim is to get back up to an 8 so I can wear the other ones again. But yeah, just a really nice light pair of jeans. And then I got this top, which I think I might take back because I'm just not sure on it. It's one that looked really, really lovely. And I think with Zara clothes, some of them are quite out there. This isn't particularly out there, but they're things that you think I'd love to look nice wearing that. But I just, I don't know. So it's kind of like an open waistcoaty cut type thing in like a camel pale pink colour. And then it's just got like the little tie that goes round it. Um, and then the last thing, second to last, this is just from my friend Marty, which I really love. I love stuff like this. She's got me presents like this before. So a little sign to hang up, which I can't wait because as soon as we move into a house, it will have a lovely little home. And it says, do what makes you happy, be with who makes you smile, love as long as you live. I just, I really like things like that. I think it's really nice. And then, this lovely smelling candle, which is actually peony and primrose, and peony is my wedding flower, so that, I just think, she didn't realise. I said to her, did she realise that's my wedding flower? And she was like, yes. But um, yeah, I just think that's really nice and sentimental. Um, and then the last thing I actually got for myself, which is a bit embarrassing, um, but it's something that I've been wanting for ages, and I did drop a few hints to people, but no one followed them. And it's this heart-shaped handprint necklace. So it's Jasper's handprint, which I just had to send off to them. And then it has his name on the back. And I love it. I think it's so nice. I'm going to do a little review of it because I just... It's just such a lovely sentimental gift <laughs> to buy yourself. Um, so yeah, that's it. That's everything... Ooh, yeah. That's everything I got for my birthday. I'll list below what I got in case it's something that you want to get for someone or for yourself. And yeah, I hope you liked it. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.